Hey everybody, this is Brandon with small-businessinternetmarketing.com and today I want to tell you a little bit about some keyword research and I'm going to show you how I do my keyword research and uh, once you do that you can implement it into your website start getting ranked on the big search engines and you can really just start getting some more traffic to your website that way okay the first thing to, that I want to show you is the keyword um, the external keyword tool that Google has and so I'm just gonna Google that external keyword tool and it's the first thing that comes up usually it's Google AdWords uh, keyword research tool and so for this example we're gonna pretend that I'm selling coffee beans okay so I'm just I'm gonna type in coffee beans and get some suggestions from uh, from the keyword tool. Just wait for Google to bring up these the keyword suggestions. Okay, now coffee beans itself isn't really that great of a keyword. There's lots of different types of coffee beans, and that's what Google is telling you here is that they're giving you tons of different suggestions of what what to use. And these are a little bit better long tail keywords that are more specific and your customers when they're looking for a more specific thing will uh, will be more likely to purchase from you uh, because they're finding exactly what they want. Okay, now here's the keyword. This is this is advertiser competition within AdWords. Uh, you don't really have to worry about that right now unless you're running an AdWords campaign. This is the local search volume in the month of February and what that means is that it's for your targeted country and language okay and this column here is the global monthly search volume that's anybody in the world searching these keywords over here and this is just uh, an average per month over the last 12 months um, so let's take uh, three or four keywords and I'll show you how I do my research let's um, let's say uh, that you're using eco-friendly coffee beans okay so I'm gonna copy this and I also wanna make sure that I'm remembering this number right here the global monthly search volume that's I'm selling I'm pretending to sell coffee beans throughout you know the entire world not just uh, the country that I'm in okay so I'm gonna I copied the keyword and remember that's 33,100 I'm gonna go to Excel and I created this little sheet here I'm gonna paste my keyword there and remember it was 33,100 people were searching that keyword. Okay, now we go back to Firefox. I'm going to copy this keyword, roasted coffee beans. Copy that and remember that's 9,900 searches. I'm just going to paste it with a keyboard shortcut, 9,900. All right, let's get one more keyword here. Um, let's go with roast coffee beans. That's a little bit of a different keyword than roasted coffee beans. 6600. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this keyword here and I'm going to show you how to find how many other people are using that keyword in their website and how many other competitors you're going to have to compete against uh, that are ranked for that particular keyword. I'll show you that in the next video.